Tekel Haymanot Tesema, also Adel Tesema, Tekel Haymanot of Gojam, and Tekel Haymanot of Gojam, was king of Gojam. Later he was an army commander and a member of the nobility of the Ethiopian Empire. Biography Born Adel Tesema, Tekel Haymanot Tesema was the son of Tesema Goshu, Negus of Gojam. Gojam had long been a vassal kingdom within the Ethiopian Empire. The title, King of Gojam, was an honorific title. The last time a king of Gojam was elevated to emperor was during the era of the princes. Like his father, Negus Tesema Goshu, Adel Tesema became the Negus of Gojam. Under Tekel Georgius de Jasmish Tesema Goshu died during his son's minority. As a result, a rival named Dastagwala assumed control in Gojam and imprisoned Adel. Adel eventually escaped to the lowlands and raised an army. After returning to Gojam and defeating Dasta, Adil submitted to Negusa Nagus Tekel Georgius who confirmed him as the Shum of Gojam and as Dejasmish. The Negusa Nagus even allowed Adil to marry his paternal sister, Lakech Gebramedin. Under Johannes IV on the 11th of July 1871, Dejasmish Kase Mercha defeated Negusa Nagus Tekel Georgius and reinstated Dasta in Gojam. On 21 January 1872, Kasse Mercher became Nagusa Nagus Johannes IV and left Gojam. Adel then returned to Gojam and killed Dasta. By 1873, Adel had consolidated all of Gojam under his rule. In 1874, Adel submitted to Negusa Nagus Johannes IV. Adel was now Ras Tekel Haymanot Tesema. On 20 January 1881, in Deborah Tabor, Negusa Nagus Johannes IV appointed Ras Tekel Haymanot Tesema as Negus of Gojam Province and as Negus of Kaffa Province. However, the latter province was only his if he was able to conquer it. Unfortunately for Ras Tekel Haymanot Tesema, Ras Menelik, Negus of Shewa, was also interested in Kaffir province. Johannes provided Tekel Haymanot with 8,000 rifles to help with the conquest. The Battle of Mbabo The followers of Negus Tekel Haymanot Tesema attempted to extend his control over the kingdom of Kaffir. But, on 6 June 1882, his forces were defeated at the Battle of Mbabo by the superior forces of Negus Menelik. Tekel Haymanot Tesema was captured and Menelik gained the upper hand in Kaffir. But Johannes intervened and, while allowing Menelik to have Kaffa, he made Menelik give Wallo province to Rasariah Selassie Johannes, his legitimate son. Destruction and submission In the late 1880s, Mahdist raiders from the Sudan encroached on Gojam and Begemda. On 18 January 1888, a large Mahdist army defeated Tekel Haymanot Tesema's army at Sawaha and Dembi. As a result of this loss, northwestern Ethiopia was open to the Mahdists who followed up their victory by entering, sacking, and burning Gonda. Thousands of Christians were captured, enslaved, and marched off to Metemma. Emperor Johannes IV ordered Negus Menelik and his Shuin army into Gojam and Begemda. Sensing a shift in power, Negus Tekel Haymanot Tesema negotiated a defensive alliance with Menelik. After Menelik secured Gojam and Begemda, Johannes ordered him to return to Shoa. In September 1888, when Tekel Haymanot Tesema refused to contribute forces to the efforts of Johannes against Mardist who had re-entered western Gojam, Johann suspected Tekel Haymanot and Menelik of plotting against him. To destroy the power of Tekel Haymanot, the army of Johannes laid waste to much of Gojam. As a result of the destruction, Tekel Haymanot submitted to Johannes. Under Menelik II in 1889, soon after the death of Johannes at the Battle of Galabit, Menelik proclaimed himself Negusa Nagist Menelik II. Negus Tekel Haymanot pledged his allegiance to the new Negusa Nagist. Menelik reinstated Tekel Haymanot as Shum of Gojam and named him as an advisor. Battle of ADWA in 1896, Negus Tekel Haymanot fought at the Battle of ADWA on the side of Menelik and was a hero of that action. 
Death Ultimately Emperor Manak determined that Gojam was too valuable a province to be held by one man and, upon the death of Tekel Haimanot, Menelik divided Gojam into three parts. He assigned the three parts to different men responsible to him. One of the men came from Shelwa. Tekel Haimanot Tesema was the father of at least three sons and four daughters. His sons were as follows. Bezabar, Halu, and Balor. One of his sons, Ras Halu Tekel Haimanot, succeeded him as Halu II of Gojam.